This is a ceremony on death. And one thing you learned, I'm just the angel representing for all the other angels. That's why y'all follow this page. Like nobody following nobody. This is just the, the group. <coughs> so, like I was saying, when you, when you realize that you was an angel on the churches, inside churches and all the places like holy places, you see the angels be people that look like they dead. That's the symbol right there. Cause one thing about an angel, the first thing they know is that they, they dead right now in this life. This life is, that's what it is, period. So being at that, which I think is my teachings, that's not my teachings. That's what I'm saying. That is actual fucking fact. This is chapter two of death. Your birthday was the day you died. The United States already know that. That's why you got a social security card, but we're not gonna talk about that shit because I don't feel like talking about government. We're gonna keep it straight, spiritual realm. Because like I said, when this realm look fake to you, you're gonna realize that this shit is invisible. This realm right here is, is, is not really here because my frequency is so high. I can see that. Y'all can't see it because the dead food that you eat make you feel like this shit is even realer because this is the death realm. So you throw all that death back and make this shit look realer. But when you can see the other side of your dreams and they look even realer than this, you're going to realize that that's the real world. Not just when you sleep. That's just a little bit of the real world. Because everybody's going to go into a body bag. That's what the fuck I'm trying to tell y'all right now. So, do y'all want to fucking do this shit together? Or do y'all want to keep being separated and being weak? Because like I said, it's almost to the point where only the strong is gonna survive. It is. Nobody's doing nothing bad. Nobody's spreading light and gonna get in trouble because they're saying stuff, no. There's people with a million followers that's saying the same shit we all talk about. We're not a threat. You know why? We're not a threat because y'all niggas won't wake the fuck up. Y'all gotta wake up. This message, if you're going to think that, oh, he cursed a lot, then you're fucking missing the point. You're, 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 you're really, you're, you don't understand why they put you in a casket, do you? I don't think y'all understand that. That was one of the rituals to make you think about it right there. Why would you go into a fucking casket? You might as well burn your fucking body and fucking turn it into dust and throw it back into a lake instead of putting the shit into a fucking wooden casket. That's crazy. That's what I'm saying. Graveyards is... That's when y'all should have woke up when y'all saw that. Real shit. It was there to scare you. You get it? Why the fuck you think Chucky, when he killed people, he laughed? Because he know they're scared and he know that they're not dying. Why the fuck you think he laughed? You think he laughed because he saw them go through pain? That's not what the, the whole point. It's coded. Y'all don't understand how shit is in this universe. I told you, nobody on this whole fucking YouTube frequency is fucking with mine. Probably some of y'all that's following me, maybe. Y'all probably fucking with my frequency, but that's because y'all angels. 
You know what I'm saying? You can't you can't put no boundary on an angel at all. You don't know what the fuck they know. Cause they might be connected with the the all. Nine times out of ten they are. If you follow this page, you connected with the all. You ain't fall for not a fucking trick. You made it far through this fake shit. See, they hide all the real the real information. You gotta type the exact letters in to find them. If it's a space between their name, you gotta put a space. They won't accidentally bring some shit like this up. You get what I'm saying? So you gotta understand. When you type this in, you gotta type it in correctly. You still might even have to look a little bit. That's how deep under this matrix they gonna find the real microchips and the keyboard cards to get the fuck out of this shit. What the fuck y'all think this shit is? Hmm. I see what y'all think it is. Y'all think this place is somewhere to play at. No, this place is where you came to fucking learn all the time. I told y'all, if y'all want to do, if you want to be the one who wake up on the dollar bill, like I'm talking about, like after this life, if you want to wake up and be the nigga on the front of the money, then you got to show God that your mind is worthy of that. Why do you think that people that get become angels, they be ready to leave? Because they next life, they're going to be on the front of the money. You get it? And it might even be a life that's longer than this. You might score, you might score one of them 500 year lives. That's what I'm saying. See, if you score one of those 500 year life and then you on front of the money, you beat this, you better, you did better than this life. Cause you only get a hundred years here and then you're in a body bag. Everybody. You get it? Why you think people want to be in a robot, get their body frozen and become in a machine? Because they're scared to die. But me, to be honest, like Bob Marley said it best. You get it? He's immortal. He was. He knew that. See, I know how this universe is being made right now. Y'all are technically, y'all are technically music. That's why music run this whole universe. Half the music that y'all really like is dead people's music. Why y'all think y'all like Tupac so much? Because we are in hell right now. Y'all didn't know this. I'm telling you, this is the only thing y'all didn't know. You knew about all these different religions was fake. But guess what? This screen, these eyeballs that you looking at, it knows that it's talking to you. You get it? Like, I know that I'm you talking to you because you are me and I am yourself. All is one. Everything is one thing. We all going back to that source. But some of y'all not gonna make it there. Y'all gonna get like a y'all gonna hit the mirror reflection. Pew, pew, Cause that's what I'm saying. None of this shit is real. None of it. That's what I'm trying to tell you. So that that's the whole key to understanding what the fuck death was. As soon as you came out your mom, you died into this world. That's how you came into it. You died into it. So this is why I try to tell you, you got people like RFG. Oh, Stonehenge is a hoax. Did you go to Atlanta? Because to keep it a hundred, I didn't pull up on it. But y'all gotta understand what a hoax is and what fake is, is two different things. Everything is fake. So if Stonehenge was there and you touched it, it's still fake to me. Because we not really here right now. This is why I'm trying to tell you. This is the highest frequency. It's scary, isn't it? It is. Because the places that I see at night, like the Akashic Records, when I go, it's always different. Sometimes that shit look like a fucking big ass library with a bunch of books. It do. Because I heard somebody else say that. So when I went, I went there looking for that version of it. And I was on that frequency and I found it. 
And I, when I got there, I was so amazed that I was looking at the Akashic Records because when I go there, it's like a library that's closed down at nighttime or something. When I, when I, well, when I went to that library one that time, it was like a library closed down at night. Like it was thundering and lightning outside, but it was nothing outside. It was just like black and white floor through the whole outside, like grass through the whole outside and black and white floor when you pull up to it. And it was like a big castle, but it was a library with all books. You seen the books lined up against the walls, different years, different alphabets, different like different kind of name codes on it, different books from different worlds. That's why these people who take DMT and shit and they go to different, they go to parallel universes and they see themselves living mad different lives at the same time. And when they come back to this one, they don't, they're not even sure if this one is real. I told y'all, somebody did three and a half grams of mushrooms and guess what happened? They got schizophrenia. I ate 14 grams. And mind you, mushrooms, only royal people was allowed to have those. Those ain't for y'all to have. Those ain't for regular people, not even rich people. Royal people is only supposed to have them shits. But now y'all get everything. Y'all smuggle everything everywhere. Y'all grow your own shit. Y'all y'all grow it right off of cow shit. But this is what I'm trying to tell you. So when y'all take those fucking mushrooms and you go to that other world or DMT... Because they got it in these other countries legally. You can do it. But you ain't ready for it. If you eat meat and all of that, don't do it. This is why some of y'all have bad trips going to hell. And y'all can't do it when y'all... You got to be... That's what they say. When you're in the right mind state, you got to be in the right diet, mind state, spirituality, and everything. Do you understand? So like I said, when you see Chucky laughing because he stabbed somebody, he's only laughing because he know they didn't really die. Y'all don't get it. That's why they make all these crazy fucking movies for y'all to watch. So they can see if y'all smart enough to decode it. I'm telling you, this be my drug right here water a fresh fiji solid rock you see that that's my drug so when i'm fucking telling y'all some shit in this fucking world y'all better understand that i'm fucking right you are not really here you just thinking this shit you think it all of this fucking religion and learning and Bible and all that I was to make you feel like this shit was real. Give you something to chase for a while so you don't fucking wake up. All of that shit is a maze. Everything. I ain't saying Jesus wasn't real. Obviously, he was real if y'all talk about him. Stupid. You get it? He was here at one point in time. I don't hear y'all talking about somebody that never existed. Do you get it? Y'all can't think like that. Y'all minds is fucking crazy, son. Like, that's what I'm trying to tell y'all. So when y'all learn to use this fucking mind right here, the way it's supposed to be used, like back in the days, Sahara, Aladdin days, like third eye, you know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying, because I'm healthy. I'm... You're not going to hear about cholesterols, none of that shit with me. I barely get headaches. I, 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 I barely, I, I don't even think I get headaches. Like, only if I, like, make myself get a headache. But, you remember when headaches was uncontrollable? Like, you just fuck around and get a headache. You, you'd be like, damn. Like, it just came out of nowhere. Like, I don't get that shit. That's because your subconscious is out of control. I told you, learn how to relax and meditate and breathe and drink a lot of water. Don't eat oil. 
And then you could just wake up to this real world that you think you in. You'll see that it was fake. So I told you, look at everybody videos, everybody talking about dimensions and seeing beings and snakes and reptiles and reptilians and it's real. It is and on a different frequency. You ain't going to see that shit here. What the fuck you think Tesla was doing in the lab? You thought he was just chilling and meditating? No, motherfucker. He was taking mushrooms and shit like that. You thought them shits just was made for you? Them shits was around before humans was here. Do you get it? Mushrooms has the same fucking DNA we got. Y'all don't understand what the fuck a mushroom is. Y'all don't. I wish y'all did because y'all would be on them right now. And this ain't even telling y'all to do drugs, see your spirituality. And that, that, them shits ain't even a drug. First of all, you could be in a certain country and just start mopping them. You could just eat them shits if you feel like it. Bitches be just... I be, I be watching them on YouTube. Bitches be clumping them whole half back. And I don't be seeing people dying either. Because we already dead. So... Like I said, when you was born, that was your death day, okay? There is no fucking birthdays. Even though I went to the simulation today and I was out with my daughter because it was my daughter's birthday, so I let her play in the pool, let her have the water guns. I was in a simulation. But you know how you look at somebody to see how long they're gonna smile at a joke. Yeah, well I was looking at myself to just to see. Just to see how long I was gonna be smiling because I seen her having fun. So I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. I'm like, damn, how long am I gonna smile about her having fun before I think about that? God damn, she's living in death. Like, damn. That's what I'm trying to tell you. This shit is bad. It is. It is.